For people that practice alcoholic behavior that identify as alcoholic, then they're actual alcoholic. 95% of people aren't alcoholics, which is why a majority of people that go to AA aren't alcoholic. You want the proof on that? <laughs> go get a DUI. <laughs> alcoholics don't get DUIs. There are less alcoholics that get DUIs than regular people that just have had one too many. <laughs> An alcoholic is very rarely going to get behind the wheel. I was a functioning alcoholic, so I, I technically drove better when I was drinking. <laughs> I learned to function like that. But an alcoholic wants to stay inebriated, and they're not going to jeopardize that. It's very rare they're going to put themselves in that situation. They jeopardize that shit. There are heavy drinkers and binge drinkers and, and people that black out and get drunk and obliterated in foobar, and then they do dumb shit. It, that's because that's their thought process before having alcohol. Remember, alcohol doesn't make you do anything. You are in a low state of mental health, and then you remove the reasons why you're taking care of yourself with alcohol. And then you do dumb shit because you don't care. It doesn't matter. And then your brain al with alcohol finds reasons why everything you're doing is completely justified. And then we want to scapegoat alcohol and go like, hey, I was drunk at the time. Bro, you ran over somebody. Bro, you got a DUI. You're not supposed to do You hurt someone. Or you really, like, set a bad example, man. Like, <laughs> like people don't like you anymore like i don't know how you even like yourself <laughs> but that's that's alcohol but it doesn't happen to everybody